Hello everyone, this is the Navy Kangaroo. Thanks for joining today. As always, I'm a 100% free team and a 100% Tigers deck. I'm laughing at that Mets card because uh, that's one of the strangest, kind of creepiest pictures I've seen on here. Um, and then look at this, we get a silver. Okay, okay, that's better than two basics. We got a bronze and a silver. So we're starting out kind of hot. Um, definitely not cold. So we got a lot of great stuff to do today. We're going to get um, at least one SIG. We're going to open this prime pack right now off the top. And then, man, I got a lot of strategy stuff to talk about. And I got three of your teams to feature, a uh, few more of your teams on deck. So um, I'll get into that in a minute. Let's see a prime, 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 prime. And we have, ooh, man, that is a sweet purple glow. And ooh, it's, it's a Cincinnati red. Oh, it's a Cueto. Quato 14 and uh, 74 overall. That is a solid, solid starting pitcher right there. That's a solid prime. Um, that would do a Reds deck very well. So that's awesome. Okay, we're going to open this uh, team select pack. And I think I got this from the club store. I'm pretty sure. And if this is the pitcher batter one, yeah, this is the one that comes up every, I think, two weeks. Bam, lightning bolt, and ooh, hopefully it's a vintage. Let's see a vintage pitcher, and we have, uh -huh, we have an E-Rod. That was not a good year for him. Last year was good. Contract year is always good, right? Even though he stepped away from the team for a while. Um, okay, team select diamond, and we're just hoping for vintages. Maybe a Max Scherzer prime diamond. Let's see. Prime, 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 and we have, bam, lightning bolt. We have no primes. Let's see a vintage. We need something good. Nope. Verlander. So instead of getting the weekly Cabreras, we are getting weekly Verlanders. Since Cabrera, I think, is out of the game. I heard that anyway. So Diamond Player Selective Pack. Let's go ahead and open this. Um, we're just into <laughs> Verlander. You can't escape Verlander. So we're going to refresh it. Maybe we get another Prime. We got that Goldsmith Prime out of here the other week. So we did not get that. But we will take this, uh, this Strasburg because that 88 overall is pretty really freaking good so that's solid that 13 strasburg he just retired by the way if you all weren't tracking he just retired we're gonna uh, combo a sig in just a second but let's get to this ultimate player pack so let's actually we'll go to team select pack really quick maybe just maybe we get a vintage or a prime out of here let's see it and no we have no diamonds so i don't really care uh really wanted something better than that and there's a scherzer 12 71 overall that's not bad Baez. I can't believe the Tigers are stuck with that contract. That was one of the last things that their former GM, Alex Avila, did on the way out uh, was that terrible, terrible bias contract. Bam! Lightning bolt. And two diamonds. Two diamonds. What do we have? We have... Uh, let me see. Oh, we got a Rushman down there. That's a pretty solid Rushman, I think. Eh, it looks a little bit low, but okay. And there we go. So we're going to keep going and let's see what we got. Uh, we'll open a few of these packs. I know, um, let's go ahead and open this, see if we get anything good out there. Yes, we needed those skill training tickets, and I'll talk about that in a minute. So I guess we'll go with these team selective packs. Um, hopefully, we're, we're hoping for vintages right now, Hope, hoping for diamond vintages, because I'm not gonna waste diamond upgrade on a vintage, because I have other stuff I need to get to, so with a diamond upgrade, if I ever get one. Speaking of diamond upgrades, the best way, and I'll open that up in just a second. Oh, man, all silvers. Yuck. Woof. That is not good. A couple Cleveland Guardians, and that's not good. I'm already full? How am I already full? Jeez, I just, I just emptied my inbox a, a minute ago. So we're going to go ahead and do the combo, but the Pick'em game, right before we do the combo, I'm just going to look at Pick'em really quick because Pick'em, you got to be playing this. I got up to, I did get a streak of eight, and then the, um, who was it, the Braves lost for me, but I was moving, I was rolling, and how you do that, I can't stress this enough, look at the odds, just look at the odds, um, you know, anything minus 250 or above, you know, 260, 275, whatever, that's really what you want to go for, because that's the best chance for winning. Um, my other strategy with that is to not to not go 
um, to not go three times in a row for one team. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and do a combo now, and then I'll get to your teams in just a second. So we'll go ahead and combo our SIG because I let off promising that. So there we go. We got the Suarez we're going to do, even though it's kind of a low one because it's a relief pitcher. Um, no, definitely not going to mess this thing up. Um, here we go. That's a solid one right there. Man, do I have anything higher? Um, all right, and I guess we'll do the Zach Granke. So let's see a Tiger. Tiger, Tiger, Tiger. Let's see it. And ah, let's hope for a Tiger pitcher. We have ah, we have an Iglesias. What is that, Iglesias? What the heck is that? Is that a relief, or, is a relief pitcher? Uh, a closer. Uh, 78 overall. We'll take a look at that in a second. We're going to go ahead and combo this Iglesias because I got a couple more SIGs on here. So we will get two SIGs today. So we'll get this Iglesias. Uh, we'll go ahead and combo that uh, vintage SIG because that's a pretty high one. And then I know I have one more floating around here somewhere. Well, I thought I did. Did I miss a SIG? It's hard to tell sometimes because they're not as clear on, let me see. Maybe I don't have the SIG. Okay, sorry for wasting your all's time there. I thought I had a third SIG on here. So um, maybe I'll look at that later. Let's just do some combos really quick and then I'll get to your teams and talk a little bit about, about some strategy. And you know what? There we go with that Matt Moore right there. That Matt Moore can't escape it. This dude's popping up everywhere now, and we did not get the Matt Moore. So, and that's fine. So he played for the Tigers. You know, he did, he had a great spring training, and I think it was his first game. He hurt his knee. He was he had a great game, hurt his knee, blew it out, was out for the rest of the year. But his Tiger and and then never played again for the Tigers. I think he played in like Korea for a year or something. And uh, but for whatever reason, his cards are still like everywhere in this game. I guess he, he must have had a good run with Tampa. And I don't know who he's with now, but he's back in the majors. Getting a lot of reds today. So I guess it's reds. To, it's, I guess it's reds day. You know, we got that red sig. Um, OK, and the Royals. There we go. The Royals. Royals are really, really impressive so far. So it's actually kind of scary to me because. You know, they're in the Tigers division. And, okay, ooh, we got a Verhagen right there. That's it? That is it? Jeez, okay, we'll go two over and, nope, uh, other way two over. So we'll go ahead and do a combo of th three, of the, three of our highest, um, three of our, let's see. Yeah, there's that Scooble Live. Okay, that thing must have gone up, that Scooble. And it's a good thing because I use my, like, Diamond Wish player pack on that. And, ooh, okay. Um, I should have kept that. What was I doing getting rid of that Scooble? That's the one I used my thing for. It's okay. I have a couple more of those Diamond Wish player things, but I got to think sometimes and, like, plan these videos a little bit better because that was just off the cuff. And look look at what happens when I do off the cuff. Okay. Um, let's see what we get here. We haven't seen any Primes pop up anywhere except for from that Prime pack. So what do we have? Okay, we got a Jennings. Um, one more combo, I think. Maybe two if we got more stuff. So we'll go ahead. Oh, we got a Trout. I wonder where I could... Oh, that Trout must have been the free one. And he's pretty low this year. Look at that. Trout is pretty freaking low this year. Um, speaking of the Tigers, you know, they pulled one out. They had lost like three of four. And lost that series to the Oakland Athletics, which uh, I wasn't happy about at all. But then they came back and they beat the Pirates on game two, which I was really happy about. And four runs in the bottom of the ninth, which, uh, ooh, man, that's always painful. When you combo three diamonds and you end up with a gold at the end, yuck. So let's see if we get, man, maybe this Hendricks. Maybe this Hendricks, just not a gold, just not a gold. We'll go, oh, that was three. Okay, fine. We got this Maeda. Okay, Maeda plays for the Tigers also, and he is just not doing very well this season. So, all right, we got more combos next week. I thought we had one more SIG on here, but I guess we don't. So next time I will prepare better because I know I have some SIGs in the backup players. So we'll get to those next time. Um, I did want to look at one thing really quick with... Um, let me see what else I had. Oh, we'll go to this special mode and this power ranking tournament. Okay, quick tip on power ranking tournament because a lot of folks are losing on power ranking tournament. So what you really need to do, what you really need to do for these teams is you have to look at the teams. You can't just look at their overalls. And so when you go to pick them, 
you look at the teams and make sure, because if you're just looking at overall, it doesn't take account the sub, the substitute players right there. And so many teams lowball their substitutes. Um, th- I think this player even, was it this this dude who, eh, maybe it wasn't this dude. One of these dudes put um, a bunch of like regular diamonds in there and it dropped their overall quite a bit. So that might have been the one I picked actually, uh, this Dodgers team. And see, look at that. So that lowers overall quite a bit, but so you just have to look at their starters because you can't count on their overall, uh, their their total overall because I don't know when it calculates their team's lineup, if they could change it throughout, but a lot of these teams that were like plus two, plus three, plus four overall uh, higher ended up losing. And that's just basically because the other team uh, kind of tanked their their reserve players. So make sure you look at that. Make sure you look at that when you're doing it. Okay, um, I'm going to get right into these teams because I don't want to take this take too long in this video. So we're going to go into friends. Um, I, a couple teams I'm going to get to really, really soon, which are going to be Bucks Bolts is going to be next week. Um, X2 Fade Atlanta is going to be next week. And... You know, I got a bunch Dodgers cards. I need you to um, just empty out one of your friend friend request things. And anyway, I'll get to and there's a Detroit team. I can't wait to check out this Detroit team. So all of your requests, I keep them in the, in line, and I will go through them one by one. So I could usually only get to about three of these videos, or else these videos are going to take like two hours, and that's not good for anyone. So anyway, we're going to get right into first. We're going to get into one, two, three, Lander. Where are you at, dude? Where are you at in here? There you are. Okay. Um, took a couple notes on here. This is a Braves team, and we have 105 overall. I have a bunch of Braves teams I got, so I'm pretty excited about about all the people who are looking at a Braves teams. So and. You know, this is this is a shame because he got a sig, but it's not. Uh, just don't resource these guys. Just don't resource this. I see he's already sixteen of sixteen. Don't level that dude up anymore. Save that for even for. So this Riley probably don't want to resource him because he's only sixty nine overall. You're going to replace Riley. Uh, this this catcher. You know, I'd resource your catcher because you'll probably have this dude for a while. It's hard to find like prime and sig catchers. Uh, you you might eventually, but go. But this is probably going to be one of your best for a while. Uh, maybe I don't know. You don't want to waste um, any sort of game coin on folks who aren't going to be in your lineup for a while, especially pitchers. This Andrew Jones is where your your resources should be going. This would be your next di- Black Diamond because Black Diamond does a lot for primes, and that is a six 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 card. Um, yep, get that slugger instinct up. And what was the other one? Concentration. Yeah, whatever. So that's just like the foul ball thing or something, which I don't mind foul ball because a mentor, I use foul, foul balls to add exhaustion because it helps during PvP. Um, anyway, great development. This dude, well, a little too much speed, I, I should say, actually. You don't need speed at all in Andrew Jones. So I would uh, I, I would actually redevelop that your Andrew Jones. Let's hurry up and get to the pitchers. And but I do like uh, this Acuna, a 75 overall for basic Acuna. That is insane. That is insane. And what is his like? Yeah, yeah, that is insane. But oh, get rid of that. Get rid of that plus one for speed. You need that for power. Um, you know, 120 speed doesn't do you much, man. You need you need 149, 150. So, but love love that you're a free to play free to play team. So that's great. So I would reverse, and you can reverse those. Um, those, those stat change tickets, and I would go ahead and do that. So here we go. Let's go ahead and see your pitchers. So you're only A overall right there. So I would end up getting rid of, um, not that dude. Well, I guess, I guess you're only pitcher. So I would end up just getting rid of this, uh, D back right there. I know it's a SIG, but it's a reserve. Just put someone else in. You, you're, you already have your, uh, S for diamonds. So you could swap that out for like a gold or whatever. It doesn't really matter. But you really need your, um, you really, and, and same with that, same with that Blue Jay, um, because you really need that, that extra plus overall. It'll make a big difference. Um, okay, shoot, didn't mean to go away so quick. Wanted to look at your pictures really quick, and then I got to move on because I'm already taking a long time. So I love this closer, this Krim, this Kimbrell. That should be another one that you plus up like, like 70 overall for a closer. That is sick. The winning streak is great for a closer. 
Um, you know, you're going to need new skills eventually, especially when you black diamond him. But black diamond that Andrew Jones, black diamond that Kimbrel, and keep those should probably be your your two. Uh, prime targets. I always say resource your ace, resource your ace, right? You should resource this ace, but, um, and, he, and again, I'd redevelop that. That's way too high stamina. So I would redevelop that and um, kind of figure out where, where you're going on this. So, um, and sorry, I just got a quick interruption, but I'm going to keep going on here. So, Anyway, that's a, that's a great team. Thanks a lot for that. I really, really appreciate one, one, two, three. Sorry, what was it? One, two, three, four, Lander. Really, really appreciate you sharing your team. And now we're going to go ahead and move to uh, Bobcast. So Bobcast is the next team. And where is Bobcast at? I know I, I saw you earlier, so we're going to get to you in just one second, Bobcast, okay? And I know I added you as a friend, so... Um, okay, well, this isn't going well, and while we're searching for something that I thought for sure I added, we'll go ahead and talk about something else, and we'll talk about PvP. I'm telling you, there we go, Bobcast. Uh, everyone's got to be playing PvP. I can't, I can't stress that enough. I can't stress that enough. I can't stress that enough. So play PvP. This is the thing. First thing I looked at for Bobcast, um, oh, man. You got a great catcher. It's a SIG. It's a wrong team, though. And this is kind of a conundrum here because that's a good hitter, but you don't want to waste resources on that. You just don't want to waste resources on um, on a player that's not going to be around for a long time. So this Freeman is absolutely sick. This Freeman Prime, 74 overall. That is a sick prime. You black diamond in him. That is awesome. What are his skills? Charisma, prediction, spotlight. Okay, so you're still boosting him up to level 20 then or level 30, I should say. This Andrew Jones, love these Andrew Jones primes. Absolutely love the Andrew Jones primes. Um, you know, a lot of fielding, uh, bad ball hitter, slugger instinct, okay. I don't really like slugger instinct with bad ball hitter, but um, it's okay. And then what was the third one? Heavy hitter, yeah. Um, heavy hitter's fine. Uh, this Hayward's sick. Love this Hayward. I wish it was higher than 69 overall, but that's great. Endurance. I would get rid of endurance. I don't know how how much uh, skills skill totals you have, how high you could go up to on each of those if you're still building them or if you're near max. Um, but if you do have quite a bit, i keep those and uh, change because Slugger Instinct's good. Chance Maker's... Uh, the, Slugger, Chance Maker's okay. But uh, what are what's his speed? Uh, One fourteen. So eh, it's okay. Um, but I would definitely get rid of endur endurance. Is garbage. Endurance is absolute garbage. Um, even for PvP, I don't like it because you just don't get enough hits for it to make uh, an impact. I really, really want to see you redevelop this this Murphy. This Murphy is a six 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 sig. Absolutely love it. I didn't know that they take vintage out of the game. That's weird, right? Because I thought once they got the license for these old folks, they um, they had them forever. But absolutely love it. Go ahead and um, you know your S S for both uh, both team deck and diamond. So that's great. Greg Maddox. I mean, this is a totally. I was looking at this card. Totally, totally sick. Love it. Um, inning eaters okay. Boss is great, and then you know you got all that stuff. This Kimbrell is really, really um, you know this is a great, great closer. You're gonna have this dude for a long time unless you get a sig. So even if you do get a sig closer, you're gonna move this dude down to because 70 overall for a reliever for a relief pitcher is is uh, phenomenal. So he'll he'll end up being a setup dude if you get someone else. The only thing I, and you got Dr. K, which is my favorite of these skill trainer things. So absolutely love that. The Bedrosian, um, that's that's good. You got some solid relievers, man. And what are you overall? 121 overall, so you're a tough team to face. And you got a really, really solid lineup. I would I the only thing I'd say is you're just gonna keep and you know, that strider's freaking sick, man. Jeez. Ah, oh, the Braves have some great cards. So you're building this thing up nicely. Love your Braves deck. Thanks, Bobcast, for sharing. And you got a really, really awesome team. And your pitchers are freaking dynamite. Okay, last one today is going to be... Uh, it's going to be Dodgers cards. So it's going to be NYY Yankees, which is my buddy from Mexico. Thank you. 
Thank you, Amigo, Gracias Amigo, for sharing your team, and we're going to get right into it. So we got another Yankees deck here, and we got Granderson. Um, you know, any good Yankees deck has one of these solid Grandersons. And look at that power. Where's he at in your lineup? He's number three in your lineup. Okay, great. The LeMayhew, man, you got a lot of primes. Dude, the Yankees have some sick, sick primes. And, ah, uh, man, but look at that Hicks. Look at that Hicks. I freaking love these Hicks cards. Uh, pretty good development. That's a good center fielder. Um, what what do you got for the skills for the Hicks? Control Master. Ooh, laser beam. Ah. And uh, get rid of exhaustion. Just please, please, please get rid of exhaustion. I hate exhaustion. Um, maybe you all do. I don't know. Since I've seen a lot of people with exhaustion, maybe you all like exhaustion. I don't know. This Voight, that's a ton of power. Ton of power, but really low eye for Voight. Decent first baseman. Um, and then, you know, Judge Prime. Any good Yankees deck has a uh, has a Judge um, Prime or, or Sig. And love the, the oh, man, a Barra Sig. You got to be freaking kidding me, man. This is an awesome, awesome, awesome card. Uh, Pioneer Charisma Prediction. Don't really like Prediction a whole lot. But, you know, if you don't have those skill change tickets to spare, then don't worry about it. You know, deal with it later. Upgrade other folks first who really need it. Um you know, your offense is just dynamite. Uh, but the only real, like, you know, man, a 66 overall, that's pretty good for your SIG. I still would black diamond him. But, and then you got this Batonsis and your closer is Miller. But I think this is one pickoff expert. This is, oh man, I actually got a, what was it? One of the, um, one of the diamonds the the diamond trainers for pickoff expert out of all the diamond things i could get i got pickoff expert so i just i'm just wondering why your closer is miller when you have uh when you have these other ones who are just um i mean look at that control master mess what you know cooperative pitching yeah that's good put away pitch is okay um not the greatest to be honest and uh maybe you know if you've done your lineup test which I highly recommend, and you really think that the that the Millers are best closer, then okay, um, go with the go with the Miller. But you could swap that out with anyone, and this green might be kind of high stamina. I get it, but if you're playing League Master mode, you get a lot of you know your closer goes a couple innings often, so it actually kind of pays off sometimes. So anyway, your ace is pretty well resourced, so I like your ace a lot. Uh, inning year, eh, okay. Winning streak doesn't really help a whole lot for, um, for, for aces. And this Gidry, uh, I mean, this Gidry is a nightmare to face in PvP. So I highly, highly recommend you resource that Gidry. Okay, um, quick check on PvP, and I'm out. So PvP so far, I've done a lot better this time. I did, I did fairly poorly last time. And uh, this is this is pretty good winning. Although I got some draws recently, I've been playing a lot of clutch hits mode just because you got to get your three. I, I can't recommend this enough. You got to get your um, your three challenges of the day, and it's it's been a lot of clutch hits modes lately. So go ahead and play that. The clutch hit store is pretty good. I, I mean, it's worth your time. It's worth your time. The rank shop is probably the best store right now, I'd say, besides the Black Diamond store and club store is always the best. You gotta be playing club mode, have to be playing club mode because the rewards are just too good with SIGs, team select diamonds, pitcher batter. You have to be playing that, those skill upgrade tickets. So, all right, uh, I'm out. I, I'll get to the rest of your teams next week and the week after. Send me your team names. I will feature them and we will see you all next time. Peace.